Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. It's Cynic Alex, and I suck with Sharon Rogers. So, in squad battle, I was in third place and I got bumped down to fourth place. Shout out to the people that are ahead of me Alpha Dog Wolfen and Secret uh, Degu pa and Power. But uh, yeah, I gotta, I gotta listen, Degu, I gotta get at least third place. We, we, we gotta get these extra Mandalay, you know, crap, crud things so that I cannot get Mystique's awakening skill for another three weeks listen so we got to get these 40 there's 40 fragments on the line people this is a serious problem now why did i say i suck with Sh sharon rogers and not anybody else well if you look at my scores here the only score that is really uh lower a lot lower than my opponents is sharon rogers now this guy's got a really good name war score 3.7 million some of these guys have higher scores with Jean gray but they've got her new uniform i don't have the crystals for that yada 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 but really well you got 2.5 million with uh professor x interesting what did i get i got 1.9 okay maybe i can get 2.5 million with professor x but really it's sharon rogers my sharon rogers is at 3.6 this guy's at 4.5 million this guy's at 5.4 million and this guy's at 4.5 million so i'm at least a million points shy of any of these guys i could put up a million more points right now with sharon that would actually put me into it would put me into third place almost put me into second place i'm not quite there yet alpha dog just blew everybody away with 17 mil which is really impressive but uh yeah so i gotta improve sharon rogers now we're gonna be playing this i'm gonna be cutting out the first two rounds i'll show you the first the first two rounds the very first time but then i will just show you the last round which is the round that's the most important against surter but first, I'm going to quickly show you my build with Sharon so you guys know that I'm not messing around here. I do have a CTP of energy. Some of those guys have a CTP of rage, but I'm sure you can get at least 4.5 million or you can get a, I can get around 4.5 million with a CTP of energy. Her uniform is, you know, pretty stacked. Obviously, everything's mythic. We've got attack speed, uh, energy attack, HP, dodge, energy attack. HP is good because of the accumulation. We've got a stage 12 overdrive, so we don't have to, you know, max that out. It's already done. We could maybe the type enhancement maybe going one more stage if i can get it no i can't get it okay maybe that, i don't i don't have we don't have any for stage four but uh and then there we've got all uh you know five star and six star uh, uh, uru with one odin's blessing and then we've got that for dodge we max out her dodge because there's basically nothing else to max out uh, and so we've got 50 percent dodge there you know what we could actually do there is one no you know what never mind i thought this was crit damage so i was going to say i could roll the other one to dodge and from dodge to crit damage and then i could do that here and, and then make that energy attack but no so we're set we got 41 almost 42 thousand energy attack pretty much everything is capped of course she gets crit rate from her fifth skill so we don't need to cap that we're at 197 for a crit damage that's basically capped so well, this is good we should be able to get 4.5 million i just need to learn how to play that's all it is i just need to learn how to play and maybe throw a ctp of insight on somebody but i'm not going to do that so here we go so the very first time i'm going to show you uh how i play round one and round two the only reason why i'm going to show you once is because uh, i feel like some people don't play round one and two well and they get pretty low scores and then you know it's not a huge difference uh if you are not competing for the top three but if you are competing for the top three, every point matters. And so if you're, you know, 50,000 points behind someone, I can I can definitely outscore some people in these first two rounds by 50,000 because I play more aggressively. Now, as you'll see, I basically barely do anything. I barely do the third skill. I don't usually use her alt either. Uh, and I basically just go and I rotate through five, one, two, three, and four. And I let the skills play out. I think that's a really important thing to remember is that a lot of these, a lot, I mean, all these monsters are basically one-shot monsters. They don't have any HP, but you know, with a tier three character like Sharon Rogers, even like a tier two character, you're going to be one shotting these characters, as you can see. So sometimes we forget, you know, her second skill is a throw and a shot. You can see there and the first skill has got a slam down, but they've got multiple hits. Some of these skills. So letting the skill play out before you tap another skill is really important because you're going to end up getting these pockets of enemies, right? They're not, they're not all going to, they're not all going to spawn um, nicely in one big circle. They're going to spawn some over here, some over there. So if you spam the skills too early, you can end up um, wasting them all and then mobs won't spawn as quickly because you can't take them out as quickly because you're waiting on your cooldown. And you can also wait a little bit and let them run to you like I did with the second skill there and, or with the fifth skill. And see, I just let that play out because it's got those extra hits at the end of the fifth skill. That's so important. I, that actually was a really bad round at 178. I, I, I should have played a little bit more aggressively. I could have gotten that mob and gotten closer to 200,000. 200,000 for the first uh, round is actually what I aim for. And then I actually aim for closer to 450,000 
for the second round. So we actually played pretty badly. That was like my lowest round ever. That's hilarious. Um, so we're going to have to pick it up here. But uh, yeah, I think letting your skills play out for the first two rounds is an important thing to do, especially that fifth skill because it's got so many hits. You can actually have mobs spawn in and get hit by the second uh, half of that skill where there's the explosion rather than just the first half of the skill where she sort of pulls her uh, spear up and down. So we're going to try here. Uh, from now on, for, for all the other runs, if we don't get uh, 4.5 million on this first try here, we are just going to skip ahead to the Surtur fight. So if you're not seeing these again, uh, you won't, uh, you'll, know, you'll know why. You won't be, you won't be disappointed because you'll have this data. I also use the, um, the auto attack sometimes. It's really, uh, you know, it doesn't really matter what you use to kill the monsters as long as they die. And I also do something where I just press the button. I just press a skill. Even if I can't see any enemies, sometimes they spawn sort of on the edges of the screen where I can't see them, but the game will uh, target them. And so if you press a button on a character that you can't see, the game will still send you over to that character. Now against Surtur, I know that with the time running out, we've got 10 seconds here, I need to not do my fifth skill or my third skill. I gotta, uh, Of course, I don't use my alt. Um, so this is actually pretty bad here. Uh, and we actually want it to be closer to him. We want to... Okay. So we got, we got to 394. Not bad. Not bad. Here we go. This is the important part here. We need to take the accumulation. And we need to pop the tier 3 skill. And we need to do a bunch of damage. We didn't proc. Alright. This is trash. Okay. So 545 is really low. For those of you wondering. Uh, we should be a lot higher. We should be at 700,000 plus. We of course also need to collect the orbs. So it's not like we can just attack him. We absolutely need to be collecting these orbs. The orbs will boost our damage. Um, and the orbs will also make sure that we don't get frozen. So that's two really important things. We take the damage there for the accumulation. The accumulation is so important with Sharon. And that's the thing that I'm kind of struggling with is uh, getting hit. I'm struggling with just letting her get hit and sort of timing things properly. Um, in order to take enough accumulation damage to then deal that and dish that over to uh, Surtur. But hopefully we can get it here because I don't want to play this all night. I do want to get this uh, done and then focus on other things in game. Uh, maybe even focus on other games. Okay, we got most of the we got most of the orbs there. We just need one more. So we're actually going to pop the tier 3. I, see, I don't know if we got enough accumulation there. I feel like we didn't. Score's not bad, though. We're going to get some more accumulation there. Sometimes I forget that her fifth skill uh, doesn't have an iframe, so her fifth skill is also really good for accumulation. We're not doing badly right now, but I think really more than a lot of the other characters where it's just like go, 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 especially um, Namor can be really aggressive to play. I think Sharon is really a lot about... See, I didn't get any accumulation here. Sharon is really about patience. Having patience. See, yeah, that was horrible. Fudge. So bad. I missed my ult, basically. He wasn't standing in it. I didn't get much accumulation. This is going to be another, like, three... Three million and change. Yeah, I think Sharon is really about patience, really about picking your spots and just slamming him um, with the alt. Yeah, there's you know the other thing is there's an iframe at the beginning of her tier three skill. So if you press the tier three too soon, then you'll dodge that incoming damage and you don't get that accumulation. So yeah, we did okay. Two point two point eight is not bad. We actually got a new record, but see, this is like a hundred thousand more than I was at. I'm still not there. Like I should be easily crushing four million, right? It's so embarrassing that I'm that I'm this low, given given my given my stats and stuff. I'm so close to passing this guy. I'm 300,000 away, not even 200 and change. So let's go again. Okay, here we go, round three. Surtur, I'm back for more, baby. Hopefully that was enough accumulation. Did we get the tier three? We got the we got the proc. There we go. That's a much better score. Okay. Gotta go collect those things. Get that. Get those nice. One more. Nice. Get all that accumulation. No, no, don't dodge. Don't dodge. Oh, nice. He didn't dodge. I don't know if that was enough damage, though. We're a little bit early on the proc there. It's okay. We didn't get any accumulation there. It's okay. We're doing pretty good right now. Okay. Don't worry about the tier three. 
Okay. Got some accumulation. Let him have it. Nice. Nice. Okay, we're doing really good. This could be the run, boys. Second run already. Let's go. Let's nuke all these little things. Run back over here. Okay, we need to take the accumulation. Oh, I don't know if that was enough. Hopefully, it doesn't move. New record. Nice. Now all these points are gravy. Come on, we gotta get one more tier three. Oh no. No, pop the tier three, go baby. Any, no! Ah, oh, three, two, is that enough? It might be. I'm so happy I got in the second run. Man, I could still, I could still get so much better, right? I could still do so much better. There we go. Just, just edged him out by a couple hundred thousand. My goodness, 4.2. That's not bad. Again, like I said, 4.5. So I can still do better. I, I wasn't aggressive enough at the end, and I missed that last tier 3. Imagine if I had built up that last tier 3 faster. I would have I would have probably gotten 4.5. So we can still improve on this. But I just wanted to show you guys. I wanted to highlight not only the, not only the fact that I love squad battle for the sense of competition between players. Again, it sucks for everyone that's not near the top 5 because you're not competing for any rewards. So obviously, they need to improve the rewards. But also, I wanted to show you guys this because I'm not perfect. I make mistakes. I'm not the best player in the game. I always have things to learn. You always have things that can make you get better. And I love these sorts of situations because now, if you're watching... Well, hopefully, you're not watching because then you won't have any time to uh, play because the season ends when this video goes live. But maybe he's at home right now. Who knows, right? It's 2... It's 3 p.m. in Korea when I'm recording this. So maybe, right? I'm in, I'm in Toronto, but maybe this guy's in Korea. And uh, and he's like, oh, shit. Cine Galaxy just, just bumped my, my, my score. Let me go get some runs in. Let me let me try to bump up my uh, whatever this score, that score, trying to get back my third place. So I'll keep you guys posted on Twitter if I end up uh, finishing in third or not. Hopefully I do. Big shout out to the guys ahead of me. There's no way I can touch down on second place. I would need like another million points basically, and I have nowhere to make that up for. Um, so yeah, hit me up with your uh, squad battle. Uh, you know, quotes or not quotes, uh, info, questions. Uh, maybe your maybe your quotes. Yeah, quotes. Like what what's your What's your rank? You know, what rank are you and who who's in your top three? Whatever, if you're competing for it. I don't know. I fudged this uh, outro. So, yeah. Love you guys. Stay safe. Wash your hands. And I will see you in the next one. I pointed at the camera twice. Take care. <laughs> uh, not a professional.